I'm going to show you how to reset the DSRM password on a local domain controller as well as on a remote domain controller. So to start, I'm logged on to one of my domain controllers and I'm going to right click the start menu and press Windows PowerShell as administrator. In the PowerShell window, we can type ntdsutil to run the utility. In the utility, we can type set DSRM password and then press enter. And then we're here, we can type reset password on server, and then we can do null. So what null does, it's not specifying a server and it will look at the local server, or you can type the host name instead to reset it on a remote server. So I'll just type null and then press enter. And now we need to type in the new password and then enter, and then type the password again to confirm and then press enter. We can see now it says password has been set successfully. And then we can just do Q and Q again to quit. So to change it on a remote server, we do basically the same thing. So do ntdsutil and then do set DSRM password and then reset password on server. And then this time specify a host name and then press enter. And now we can type the password that we want to set on that server. And there we go, password has been set successfully. That's how to change the DSRM password on a local or remote domain controller.